Hello everyone, welcome to Linux Help Tutorial. Today we are going to discuss about Linux system monitoring tool Glances. So it is a free and open source. It was written in uh, Python language. It is used to monitor uh, our system performance like uh, CPU status, load average, memory details and etc. Let me see how to install and use this Glances monitoring tool. Now first step I am going to install uh, glances package by using yum install so make sure before install so make sure before installing this glances package you should enable your apple repository so once you enable your apple repository now the next step you should you should go on installing procedure of uh, glances so after enter this command hit enter now now press y to continue now the package will be installed successfully now the next step i'm going to show how to use this glance tool now type command glances to open the glances tool so hit enter now so now your glances monitoring tool will be page will be successfully installed and this is your status of your uh, machine so you can, here you can see the CPU information, load statics, and network information, and uh, disk information, and many more. So now the color coding shows if it is green means all all uh, setups or all configuration our system will be safe. So it will be turned to blue means here here blue will be shown here. So we must be careful indication for blue color. Suppose the color should be a uh, violet means it will be a warning so show is here here warning will be shown here so it will be shows a uh, violet color so suppose your system will be suppose the color should be a red means it will be a critical state so these are the color identification for this uh, glance tool so now i am going to show some options to use this glance monitoring tool if you want to monitor short your cpu status means press c in your keyboard so here highlighted cpu so you can monitor the cpu status with highlighted this option now next if you want to uh, short the memory status means press m so it will be short the memory status so it will be highlight the memory process you can easily identify the memory details now now the next I am going to press P option to highlight the process by name so by press P so here the process will be highlighted in name now next I am going to short the input output rate by pressing option I so here you can see the input output uh, status by separated so you can monitor easily so now the next option if you want to hide the disk status information means press D so your disk status information will be hided now if you want to again replace means again press D it will be replaced if you want to hide the file system information means press F it will be hided now again press F it will be placed so same procedure to hide your network status information by press N it will be hidden again press n it will be replaced so next i am going to delete the warning message and critical message so see here four three warning messages there and one critical status message is there so i am going to delete first i am going to delete the warning message this is not necessary if you need means you can delete so now first i am going to delete warning message so press w to delete your warning informations so your warning will be deleted so again if you want to delete the critical message information means press x so your critical status information will be removed so if you want to quit this glance terminal means press q so it will be quitted now uh, next i am going to show glance with option t so option t is nothing but time interval so it will be refresh the 
glance page every three every n second you are giving so i am giving three seconds here so every three seconds will uh, my glance page will be refreshed so after enter this command hit enter now so glance page will be opened so automatically it will be refreshed every three seconds so you can assign your uh, time seconds depot on your options so this is the method to check set your time interval at a glance so I'm going to quit this page now now the next is if you want to check the version of glance means press glance iPhone V now hit enter now it shows the current version of uh, glances so you can check the your uh, version by using this method so next I am going to show one of the main concept in this glance so I am going to connect server client mode in this glance tool so let me see how to do this so now use glance i1s for server turn on so after under this command hit enter now so after under this the output will be shown like this so which means your glance server is ready to connect now I am going to connect my client machine into this server let me see how to do this so this was my client machine so IP for this machine is uh, 5.63 so I am going to take control for my server machine by using following steps. So this is the glance command with option C enter your server IP. So after enter this command hit enter now. So now your uh, server machine status will be shown here. You can easily monitor by server client method by using this option. So here connected server status will be shown here. Your 5.82 is will be it's a server IP it will be connected to this client machine successfully and you can easily monitor the system status of the server machine so once you see means now press Q to continue so after this monitor your server client means now press now cancel the settings so now next if you have doubt in this glance option means press glance iPhone H for help hit enter now so it will be shows the options how to use this now you can easily understand this options and use the portable options for access this glance now next is so this is the configuration file of your glance so after enter this command hit enter now so this is the glance page so this is nothing but your threshold value will be mentioned here threshold is nothing but your color coding I explained before this was red yellow status and uh, warning status everything I mentioned on that, that that configuration only done here here the issue 50% will be reached means it will be mentioned in careful and 70% uh, reached means warning and 90% uh, reached means it will be mentioned as critical so same settings for done in uh, load monitoring and also memory monitoring and also swap and also disk status everything as a system admin you should enter a portables value for alert here so that's all about here the setting status once you enter the settings means save and quit this configuration file so this is the efficient method and easy method to monitor your system status by using this glance tool that's all about this tutorial. Let me see you on another video. Thank you.